Hey guys, today I'm gonna show you how to properly shave or trim your pubic area and your balls using the Lawn Mower 3.0. So first things first, when you're taking your razor or trimmer, you really want to hold it correctly. I see a lot of guys kind of mess this up sometimes and they will take the razor and they will go like straight at it and kind of scratch along the surface like it's a back scratcher. But you really want to flip it around and use the back of the razor to glide against your skin and then press the blade that way. It will make it a ton easier. You're gonna get a smoother shave and it's not gonna leave any scratch marks on your skin after you're done shaving. So. To trim your pubic area, this is gonna be pretty simple. I would just say, pull your shaft out of the way, pull it down, make sure the skin is tight and not bunched up because when you get your skin bunched up and there's wrinkles in there, that's when you get snags and nicks. And then when you wanna move on to your balls, treat it the same way you would treat your kneecap or your elbow. Just kind of pull the skin tight around it, give it one simple, easy trim, and then move on. Pull a different part of skin tight, trim that off, then pull a different part of skin, trim that off, and go very, very slowly, guys. This is, you know, the most tender part on your body, so you really gotta be careful. You really don't wanna to touch the jagged edges to your ball sack. So that's why kind of keeping the razor on its flat edge and going along that way is going to help protect you and help you keep from getting nicks and cuts. One thing I have found if you wanna reduce the risk of nicking yourself, but you don't care about getting the closest shave possible is to use the guard that they provide on the shortest setting. So if you guys aren't familiar with Manscaped, they have been pretty much one of the leaders in the pack when it comes to grooming your downstairs business with their lawnmower 3.0 with the replaceable blades and the ergonomic design. They put more power into it, um, it has a longer battery life, and there is a flashlight on there so you can see all of the nooks and crannies that you need to get to. I would 100% recommend the Lawnmower 3.0 to you guys. So that pretty much wraps up the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to Manscaped. Give them a look and check it out.